Hey y'all, this is Anna Alexander. Welcome back to my basement on this Friday. It is a Friday. I finally got my Godzilla minus one reaction out the door. CRT file, if you're wondering what my hangup was. At least I think it was the CRT file. <laughs> but I'm here to catch up, hopefully, because it appears that next week, this next week, everything in existence is dropping at once. We've got second half of season three of Bridgerton, season two of House of Dragon, The Boys. I think season four of The Boys is coming out. So I'm going to try to watch as many episodes as I can of Lucifer. So we are here, season two, episode 13. So it's been revealed to Lucifer that Aminadil and Dad has made, helped put Chloe into existence. And in true Lucifer fashion, he went <laughs> zero to a thousand forgetting about something called free will. That even if Chloe was put on the earth, the chances of them crossing paths, although, gotta hand it to dad, he, he made, I wouldn't say Lucifer's dream woman, but Chloe, I think, ticks a lot of the boxes that we've seen come through in Lucifer's life. Anywho, but, pfft, but before he had a chance to go full on, did you know she's dying? She's been poisoned. Of course she is. How are they going to save her with the doctor who had the antidote in his head? Gone. <laughs> so we're going to watch and we're going to find out. So thank you so much for being with me. It's been a day. So, you know what? I don't even know if I'm going to get under the blanket. I'm warm. It's been warm today. I've been running around. So maybe I may or may not have the cozy blanket, but I am starting my night with, yes, I said starting. I got a glass of Riesling. I hope you have your favorite beverage with you. And also you're gonna remember a full episode watch along is available on Patreon. I would love to see you there. Okay, let's get to it. And other times I'm all too human. Appears you make me vulnerable too. What's in that package? Is Ooh, yeah, that's right. Chloe makes Lucifer vulnerable. Is that a dad thing? Is that a dad thing? Because it was not always thus. Oh, did he drive her in her car? Yes, he did. Maybe it's just a nosebleed. I mean, I how could the professor have injected me? I didn't get one of his flu shots. He stabbed you in the side. He stabbed you in the side. Got into the ground. We we struggled for a bit. And he just... <sighs> we can't go to the hospital. What? Lucifer, going to the hospital didn't help any of the other victims. So you're, what's your proposal then? The only thing that's going to save my life is finding the antidote. But you'll still need medical attention as your insides do things. He took her to the police department. He took her to the police department. Wow. Let's go over what you found at the professor's lab, okay? We should tell her. No, we can't. She'll freak out. It'll get in the way of the investigation. Okay, but the other poisons had corresponding antidote. Did you find anything to match this one? I did. Great! Problem is, dude destroyed whatever was inside. Of course he did. I mean, that's why I'm glad no one's reported to any hospitals, because without the antidote, ugh, they'd end up just like the other victims. Fainting spells, followed by seizures. We get the point. And then their guts slowly start boiling, like literally boiling. It's so gross and nasty, and 24 hours later, bam, just like that, dead as a Got doornail. It. Thank you. Why are you there? Why are you there? Why is he there? Now, now. I got your text for some Oh, he texted him, okay. <laughs> I keep expecting him to have some cosmic link still. Oh, we're gonna do this now. That you put the detective in my path. No, I didn't. Mm -hmm. Father did. I was just another pawn in his game. The detective. Is she? She doesn't know anything. <sighs> Father has manipulated us both. All that I have ever wanted to do. I had a thought. I had a thought. This was make Father proud. I thought I was doing great works in his name. Instead, the very first of his angels. 
was busy making you a little girlfriend. How deep does Father's plan go? Is the detective's poisoning part of it? Poisoning? You really don't know? No. You can't help her. Okay, so the professor has been using this bird guy to smuggle poisons. I see, I think the bird might have smuggled the antidotes as well. And these antidotes don't need to be stored in a special environment. Am I saying it's Lucifer? <laughs> it's not going to be that deep. They think they can keep me down. Me. He's doing this while he's on bail. Party every night until the trial. And then every this broke ass bitch. Tell Lucifer shows up at the door. Oh, sorry. Sorry. No. No, you can bump into he me anytime. Didn't realize she was, she was, she was. Yes. Weren't you at that beach party? Yes. Yeah, I was. I, I'm stalking you. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Uh. You, you okay? No, no, I'm fine. I'm fine. What were you saying? Yeah, maybe not. No, that doesn't really work for me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, are we gonna get Lucifer working his magic? Uh, sure. <laughs> yes! Remember me? didn't smuggle the antidote. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Detective. Sorry. Detective. Detective. Yes, because screaming detective is going to make her go, yep, I'm up. <laughs> I know. He's panicking. How are you feeling? Fine. Lucifer, I told you no hospitals. Too bad. We'll take it from here. Yes. Yes, we will. And we'll start by following up on your lead. Dave Maddox is... Is Trixie here? She should be any minute. Here's the thing about those poisons. I keep thinking they're viruses and that she's going to contaminate Trixie everybody. I'm scared seeing me like this. Do I look okay? You... You look heaven sent. Dude. Just... Follow my lead and don't do anything unless I say, okay? Where are they? You have my word. Gallery. Okay. What if self-respecting artists would actually display this? Dave Maddox isn't a real artist. See, criminals like Maddox, they use art sales to cover up money transfers. We need to talk. And it's about your other business, specifically with Professor Jason Carlyle. So you're, you're, you're trying to help your ex-wife? Can they not flash the badge? Does the badge not, not work with this? She's anything like my ex? I say let her die. <laughs> I don't think they're using their strengths at this moment in time. Right, I'm not sure what lead I'm following here, but am I supposed to let them punch me too? I let my anger get the better of me, and now Chloe's gonna pay for it. Well, so this isn't some elaborate game of bloody possum? Of course not. Oh, well, in that case... <laughs> yeah. I was like, what is this plan? What is this plan? Right, oh, 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 I'm getting all the things what I love. Did you stop it from being a crap at me? Because I promised you I wouldn't do anything without your permission. Oh, right, of course. This is gonna have to take a swing and I'll shove that so far up your ass you'll have splinters in your stool. You have something we want. What would you like in return? I, I want someone to buy my art because they actually like it. Dude. Just to be treated like a real artist. Really? That's it? <sighs> Fine. Well, miracles aren't my thing, but I'm sure <laughs> we can come to an arrangement. <laughs> what? You're not the one that has to look at this monstrosity every day. Okay, now. Here you go. This better be worth it. What is this? It's the antidote ingredient. Well, what about the formula? What about it? It's in his head. You still want the painting, though, right? Why can't they arrest him on money laundering? Suspicion of money laundering? Smuggling? I can't even go in there. 
I'd have to tell her how monumentally screwed she is. Oh, or lie. Oh, oh, oh. Any consolation, you of all people should know that the man that did this is right where he belongs, suffering in hell. You're right. That's it. <laughs> um, you figured it out, how I'm going to save the detective. How are you going to get to hell without your coin? How? Well, it's simple. <laughs> all I need to do is die. And then how do you get back? Kill me, I go down to hell, interrogate the professor, get the formula, and then you bring me back. How? I absolutely forbid it. I hate to agree with her highness, but she's right. Well, I went down and came back once before. It wasn't a problem. Mm. That's because father brought you back. Mm-hmm. Once you do, you could be trapped forever. You can't be certain that this will work. <sighs> what do you think? Oh, <laughs> oh, that I followed oh, oh. about half of that. I love this so much. We would have had a meeting about carelessly revealing our true nature to a human, which she has apparently known about for a while and kept from me. I thought you knew. I thought he knew. But what makes you so sure you go to hell? In case you'd missed it, Doctor, I've been banned from heaven. There's nowhere else for me to go. Purgatory? I'm in a deal. Are you coming? No, Mom, I'm gonna help. Okay, okay. She doesn't deserve this. This is the craziest plan I've ever heard. I'm in. Surely you have some sensible advice. Um, he's the devil. <laughs> Nothing's really been sensible since I found that out. <laughs> Not help you get trapped down there. I, s I get Mom's fear. Well, I get Mom's fear about being trapped. She doesn't understand why he's willing to risk it. But I get her fear. What's my part in all of this? Well, you went to medical school, correct? <laughs> Not that kind of doctor. So you'll be the one bringing me back from the dead? Not that kind of doctor. Okay, who wants to kill me? <laughs> wow. I'm about to get the formula. What? How? Fairly certain you don't want to know. Eleanor will get those ingredients. Right. It's gonna say goodbye to her. One last time. Lucifer's going home. Oh. This is crazy. I can't do this. Can I? Oh my gosh, I had the doctors. These are so boxy. Even I can't pull them off. <laughs> Scratch that. <laughs> I can pull off anything. Make sure no one moves the detective. I'll be in the room below, but she needs to remain in there for this to work. And you trust me with this? You're the most stubborn, bull-headed person I know. If anyone can prevent the detective from being moved, it's you. Well, based off the list from that middleman, dude, we've gathered all but one. A chemical called ZX3. Super rare, super illegal. How rare? Too rare. Let's put it this way, all my legal contacts are out of this stuff. Some street racers secretly add drops of ZX3 to their fuel for a super shady advantage. How do you know that? I used to steal cars. It's no fun if you don't drive them really, really fast. I know where some black market CX3 is locked up. I'm not sure I can get the owner to hand it over. And we don't have time for it. How much do you need? Right, so one zap of this doohickey will stop my heart. And they don't need this room, the hospital, for actual, actual patients. It's just available. 60 seconds, I've had orgasms that last longer. Time moves much slower down there. This, what if you yank me out before I get the formula? Work fast. You ready? I can't. You do it. No, 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 no. No, the deal was you kill him, I bring him back. But you're the doctor. Okay. If you're the demon from hell. Goodness sake. <gasps> oh, jeez. Wow. 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 He's really dead. Wow. And will the doctor give it to him? That's the thing. Will the doctor give it to him? Okay, Lucifer, move fast. How in all of the realm of hell would you know where the doctor's at? Who are you? I'm Lucifer's brother. He uh, asked me to watch over your mom. Like a guardian angel? <laughs> <laughs> bad man did this to my mommy. Why are there bad people in the world? There might be bad people in the world, but you know what? There's a lot more good people in it. Like you? 
Well, I'm, uh, I'm trying to be good. I think you're good. Wow, that's a trusting little soul right there. Help! Yes! Hey! Oh, this is his hell to relive this over and over and over again. And this man didn't have a backup of his work anywhere. In any capacity. Cloud. Photocopy. Remember me. Microfiche. It keeps happening over and over. It's like I'm in hell. There's no like about it. Uh... This is a torture of your own making. Filled by guilt. With a little bit of flair thrown in for fun. How do I get out? Well, it's quite simple. You can't. Not until you no longer believe you deserve it. And I've never seen anyone pull themselves out of here. Wow. How do I make amends? Well, if you give me the formula to her antidote, perhaps your guilt might be alleviated. Quarter cup of XZ23. Does that make us good? Two tablespoons of honey. <laughs> I didn't think so. Oh, he's taking pleasure in this. Okay, it can't, could not have been that simple. <gasps> Where's a resurrection when you need one? Why did you... I would at least tuck it in my pocket just cause. Did Lucifer send himself himself to hell? So there's him as devil and then Lucifer him? Oh, that would be something. <gasps> no. Couldn't be. Can't be. It can't be. I never could play as well as you, brother. He's supposed to be wiped from all existence. Oh, and he's in Lucifer's place. It's a lot to take in, isn't it? Yeah, and Azrael's blade, it should have destroyed you, not sent you to hell. You don't deserve to be here, brother. You're right, I don't. But you do. Is this a trick of his mind, or is this really happening? <gasps> you think it's that easy to let go? Think again, brother. <sighs> <sighs> No, 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 what's happening? You're in a hell of your own making! I thought you said this was like that. Shh, clear! This is always a terrible idea. There's shit going down. I'm, 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 I'm. Where did you learn to pick a lock like that? My grandma. Hey! You picked the wrong place to rob. Dan? Dan is being not... Quick on the. <laughs> I, I don't want this. Look at you, so pitiful, stuck in the very hell you once ruled, trapped by your own guilt. <laughs> or you didn't even follow up on that thing I told you. What I whispered in your ear before I died. Oh yeah, we never heard what it was. Peace is here. The peace is here. As in hell. The pieces in hell? I hope you didn't leave any unfinished business up on Earth. Because you're never getting out of here. <gasps> Help me. Are they tied together? I don't know. Let's go wait outside. Are they tied to are they tied together? He's stuck. Trapped in one of those cells. That's why we can't revive him. Someone needs to go down there and pull him out. I'd go, but I can't. Demons don't have a soul. If I die, I just die. Right now, every second counts, and I can't believe I'm saying this, but... Kill me? Wait, no, what? What if I go? What? Linda! Linda! That's a sacrifice! That's a sacrifice! No way. But Maze, send me. <gasps> well, look who decided to show up. Yeah. Yes, I have a paralyzing fear of the place, but I would face a thousand hells to save my son. So how do we do this? I love how mom found them. <laughs> she just knew which one to go to. <laughs> Maze. Oops.
But she still has her jacket on. They both still have their jackets on. And they're just letting a minute he'll stand there in the room while this is happening. We need to move her to CT. I'll call up. <gasps> Sir, you need to move. I can't let her leave. We're trying to save her life. So am I. Ricardo, tranquilo, okay? No says it's stupid. I'll lower the gun. Do you know who he was? Ella? <laughs> She's like, dude, I'm, co I'm coming over. You know this guy? This is her brother. Dan, meet Ricardo, my idiot brother. And she couldn't say, hello, I'm coming over? Yep. And why didn't you just ask him for the ZX3? Because after I moved out here to keep an eye on him, he totally ghosted me. All right, I can't take any chances. Ricky, the ZX3 is for a friend. Without it, she's going to die. Follow me. I love you, too. Jeez. Uh, this episode. Look what I've done. But it's just a part of your hell. This isn't your fault. Mine. What is this? Ever since I returned, I've been... I've been manipulating you. Mm-hmm. I just made things worse. No, I killed Uriel because I had to, to save you, to save the detective. And I need to save her now. Mom! Why would we leave? Uriel is right here. We could stay a yeah, happy family. All of us could stay. You pulled me out of my guilt. There's no time to get stuck in yours. Come on. Please Come. don't abandon me. Does mom have powers down in hell? Or is she stripped of them all? I'm alone. Feel like home. What do you got? Oh! You love me. Don't let go. And you gotta move faster. Are they gonna tease him from behind? Does this bring Chloe back? Now you can let her go, and they're gonna go. What the fuck's happening? <laughs> What's happening? He went to hell for her. Look who's back. He didn't die after all. He went to hell for her. You know, this whole poisoning thing is just really put a pause on everything that's been going on with you and I, so. We need to take a break. Should we just pick up where we left off? Oh, oh, okay, that's the opposite of what I... I think right now, you just need to focus on feeling better, Detective. Well, it was never real, was it? Father brought her into existence just to put her in my path. But that's it! That's it! He just put you there. He didn't tell you what to do. I mean, how can I trust anything, anyone, now that I know he might be behind it all? Well, you can trust me. Can I, Mum? You're as bad as he is. But she went down to hell? I went back to hell for you. I helped save the detective for you. Mm -hmm. Doesn't that count for anything? It's too little, too late, Mother. He's being so Lucifer! I am tired of being a pawn. So no more. I'm done. Lucifer! <laughs> I have thoughts. Voicemail 337. <laughs> Jesus, Mary Joseph. It's just that you, you haven't been picking up. Uh, I'm on my way over. Lux better be there. Lux better be there. That place better not be empty. It's the equivalent. And he left the whiskey. What the hell? <laughs> uh, that was a hell of a lot of effort he went in to save her life to just go pee. 
peace with no word about why. Uh. <laughs> He's such a teenage girl. <laughs> I wasn't even that much of a teenage girl when I was a teenage girl. <sighs> right, so I thought I had it earlier. The Minadil. Okay, God uses a Minadil to go down, bless the Deckers with a child. That was a Lucifer plan, right? Or did God also have a plan for a Minadil? Knowing that at some point in time, Lucifer being where he was, was Chloe, that, Chloe, Chloe, Chloe there as a gift, a distraction. Why, why? We don't know the why. You know, my favorite question. Why did he put Chloe there? Is Amenadiel part of that plan? Did he want Amenadiel to fall? Have doubts? Be stripped of everything he identifies with? To make him stronger? To make them all stronger? I know we have what, three and a half more seasons to find out the why. But that's what I'm wondering. <laughs> them, them, story creators, pulling Linda into the whole scenario. Unexpectedly delightful, but her sacrificing herself to go to hell for Chloe and Lucifer. Well, that goes beyond friendship patient client relationship um i think it seemed so crazy pants because we haven't seen her journey with chloe and lucifer like we have with lucifer and chloe to make her that having that sacrifice make sense but lucifer bugged out to go where not back to hell miami i don't and for being the kid of a cop, Trixie is pretty, pretty free with the strangers. Here's the strange man who claims to be Lucifer's brother. And she's going to say, oh, I know you're good and gives him a hug. I'm sorry. Stranger danger. Stranger danger. Stranger danger. Okay. Okay. But there we go. Episode 13. <laughs> Where are we going to go next? <laughs> but thank you so much for being with me on this venture. I do appreciate it so much. So until then. Take care of yourselves, stay hydrated, sunscreen, it's sunscreen season, so sunscreen it up, um, and then come back and watch the next video in the queue. That's it, that's how you perfect sun cancer, just stay inside and watch the next show. <laughs> so until next time, y'all. <laughs>